Hi, this is Easy Chinese and I'm Jenny. Today I'm going to teach you some words describing positions and some prepositions. In the first one, it is a person inside a house. So it means inside. It is written like this currently and the pronunciation is ne a ne false tone means inside and I introduce you a phrase nei ren, nei ren. a person live inside it refers to wife normally in the past uh, currently people don't use this word often but in the past um, you know women um, not us, us always coming out and they always live in inner side of the house. So when a man refer to their wife, they say "内人" means wife. Shu, Hong Zhe Go. So we start from outside and inside. Pie Nai. Nei, inside. These characters is a little bit complicated. You are neighboring country's people entering your own territory. This represents yourself. This is the person from your neighboring country coming out from their cave you know, where they live and enter. This represents enter into your own territory. This is a nose actually. It's a nose. Nose means yourself. And so this character uh, evolved like this. I will teach you later, it means yourself. And uh, remember this shape was the direction, fang. Um, and uh, this is the traditional way to write it. And this is the simplified. Bo yi an, bian, bian. If we form a few phrases, use the characters we have learned. Shang means top, right? Shang bian top side, xia bian lower side or bottom side. How we write it? We start from um, the left outside. Dia hang zhe zhe. And this pier a, a bit tricky. You give a little bit uh, slightly curve like this. And then we write this half li. Remember strength or power? Hung zhe go pie. I can demonstrate this uh, again. Dia hung zhe zhe pie. Hung zhe go. You see a character with a radical like this. It always related to um, like a walking, marching, uh, you're entering. Uh, this character, the top, the upper part is Tian, farmland, we have learned. The lower part is Tu, the earth or the soil. And put them together, it means inside. Actually, in the past, originally, it means like 25 families uh, gathering and living in one area. So it also is a measurement. It is with Chinese like to use one li. The pronunciation is li. Le yi li. Yi, yi li equals to 500 meters. And also means a place for people the gathering and living together. Currently, many cities, even in Shanghai, in some places, the address has this character also. Le yi li, the third tone, means inside. Li bian means 
inside, 边 side, 里 put together means inside. 竖横折横横横竖横 The order of the strokes, we always write 横 first, and then 竖 later. Look at this image first. The left side is a moon. The right side, this character represents actually the divination. In the past, when the king uh, always liked to do the divination almost every 10 days, um, normally this um, divination will only do it during the daytime. However, if there is anything happened, um, um, emergency happened, like um, you know, the, someone invaded from the border, from the outside uh, of the border, and then they need to do it in the night. When they need to do it in the night, of course, under the moon, uh, which something uh, emergency happened. And this pronunciation be uh, as a uh, bu and put together means outside. This part simplified like this and this. The pronunciation is wu ai wai, fourth tone. Wai means outside. Wai guo ren means foreigners. Wai yu yu is language, foreign language. Here, heng pier, diar, shu, diar, wai, outside. I think uh, it would be better I teach you another word which is very similar with this wai, outside. Look at this, only one stroke is different from this. Here is a dot. But this one is a na, na. This character means stay, stop, or a place, or your position. Pronunciation is chi wu chu, false tone. Pier, heng, pier, na, shu, dian. Chu means a place or you stay or stop. This is an image. This is a foot stepping on the front of a boat. It evolved like this. Actually, boat currently should be written like this way, um, but this one, how it was evolved, but it was like the moon. Remember, this character is the moon, but it should be um, a, a boat like this. But anyway, remember, it is a, a moon now. The pronunciation is Tian Qian, means front, before, or previously. We can form a phrase Tian Fang, remember Fang direction, means front direction. 前边, front side, 点儿, 撇, 横, 撇, 横, 折, 勾, 横, 横, 竖, 竖, 勾. If you see this shape, this image, actually it represents your left feet. This is the big tone. This is your, you know, the shape of your feet. And this is uh, a person. Your feet is a head yourself, means a head first or before. Xian, Xian, Xian. If you say uh, someone is uh, Xian Ren, Xian means, um, right, uh, someone ahead of you. So it means your predecessor or your ancestor. Pie, heng, shu, heng, pie, shu, 
折钩，先 ahead or before or first. So this is、um, an image that this represent string. String tie up your feet, so then you cannot walk fast, and you are behind. So this character now is like simplified version is like this, and means behind. We have just learned、uh, ahead, so this means behind. And if you say 后人 and、uh, means next generation. Our offspring here, Pie, Heng, Shu, Heng, Zhe, Heng. This is a remember, 口 mouth. Remember, this shape, this image, is a hand, your right hand, and this shape represent you flip your hand, reverse side of your hand. So this character now is like this, and it means reverse flip side or your opponent. For an, fan third tone, fan here, here, hang, here, nai. So this exactly an image of your left feet. Little, and then it is written like this. Simplified version means stop. Pronunciation is z z third tone. It is written like this. Shu, heng, shu, heng. Yeah. How about we put yi heng just on top of this z stop? It is means. Right amount or right time, not too much, not too too, too less. It pronunciation is z, n, z. Right place, right amount. Write it like this: 一横一竖，一横竖横。These two characters are not.、Uh, The character describe your position or preposition, but I think it is better to learn it with、uh, the word we have just learned: stop, or、uh, right, right place, right time,、uh, because they, they are very similar, very similar. Remember, we have learned this is your left feet and this is your right feet. You put your right feet and the left feet. It forms a step, so this character means a step. Pronunciation is bu u bu stop on the top, and this is means less actually currently, but it was coming from this shape and means a step, a foot step. And this you put this on the lower part and the top. Looks like an earth or a soil means walk. So you put these two characters together. So, bu. It means you are walking. Shu, heng, shu, heng, shu, pie, pie, bu. Step, a footstep. Heng shu, heng shu, heng pie nai. Zo walk. Let's learn learn a a simple one. Okay. Remember this character we have learned. A shi ten, uh, and one small stroke. This means dry. Uh, gan dry means dry. And if we just put a, a small stroke、um, on the bottom here, it、um, changed the meaning completely, and the pronunciation also. This means off or at, and pronunciation is yu 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 second tone. 
uh, we, if we say 大鱼 means more of, 小鱼 less of, 横, 横, 竖, 勾, 鱼, off or at. <laughs> Remember these two characters we have learned before? 左, left, 右, right. And uh, this character I'm going to teach you today is quite similar in terms of writing, but the meaning is uh, different. This means at. Normally describe like what time or what place you always start with this character. The pronunciation is zi, ai, zai, the fourth tone. This part is the similar, it's the same actually. Heng, pie, but then shu, heng, shu, heng. This looks like also the character we have learned soil or the earth to zai, at. I'm going to teach you a character which exactly the same pronunciation, zai, but a different meaning means again. The tu is in the middle, right here. So it is heng uh, shu heng zhe go heng shu. Heng, zai, means again, zai jian. It always, um, it's like a, you, you say goodbye, means see you next time. Jian, see, zai, again, see you again, zai jian. Let's recap the words describing the position or prepositions. Shang, up, xia, down. 左, left, 右, right, 前, front, 后, behind, 内, inside, 外, outside, 里, inside also, 反, reverse, flip side, 正, right or front side, 于, at, off, 在, at, 在, again, 边, side, 处, it's a bit similar, it's not a, a, a preposition, it means a place or stop, a stay, but it's quite similar. 先, ahead, 指, stop. These two characters are not uh, describing the position, but it's quite similar with uh, 指 or 正. This means a footstep. 步, 走, walk, 先, ahead. Okay, that's all for today. Until next time, 再见。